Hello dear viewers, welcome back to my channel for another exciting video. In today's globalized world, migration is a ubiquitous phenomenon. Millions of people across the globe relocate seeking better opportunities, fleeing conflict, or simply exploring new horizons. However, some countries remain largely untouched by this wave of human movement, boasting remarkably low immigration rates. Today, we embark on a journey to explore seven such countries, delving into the historical, geographical, political, and economic factors that contribute to their unique demographic compositions. But before starting the video, do subscribe to the channel, if you have not subscribed yet and hit that bell icon to receive every video notification. Japan an island nation with strict immigration policies. Japan, a nation steeped in tradition and cultural isolation, ranks among the countries with the fewest immigrants. Strict immigration policies, along with a homogenous population and a strong emphasis on national identity, have historically limited foreign immigration. This has resulted in a population that is 98.5% Japanese, creating a distinct demographic landscape. Iceland a remote island with a sparsely populated landscape. Iceland, a breathtaking island nation nestled in the North Atlantic, boasts a stunning natural landscape and a remarkably low population density. With a total population of just over 350,000, Iceland has limited opportunities for economic migrants and a relatively homogeneous population. This, coupled with its remote location, has contributed to the nation's low immigration rate. Bhutan a Himalayan kingdom prioritizing cultural preservation. Nestled in the majestic Himalayas, Bhutan is a kingdom known for its unique cultural heritage and emphasis on gross national happiness. The Bhutanese government prioritizes preserving its cultural identity and traditions, leading to strict immigration policies that favor skilled professionals over unskilled labor. This has resulted in a population that is over 99% Bhutanese. South Korea, a rapidly aging nation with limited immigration requirements. South Korea, a technological and economic powerhouse, faces a rapidly aging population and a shrinking workforce. Despite this, the nation has historically maintained a low immigration rate, favoring a homogeneous population and stringent visa requirements. However, recent economic shifts and demographic challenges have led to a gradual opening up to skilled immigrants, albeit cautiously. Qatar, an oil-rich nation with a transient workforce. Qatar, a small but oil-rich nation on the Arabian Peninsula, relies heavily on foreign labor, particularly in construction and service sectors. However, due to the transient nature of this workforce, Qatar does not experience significant permanent immigration. This results in a population that remains largely composed of Qatari citizens, despite the high number of temporary foreign residents. Tuvalu, a small island nation facing environmental challenges. Tuvalu, a tiny island nation in the South Pacific, faces the existential threat of rising sea levels. This, coupled with its limited landmass and resources, restricts the nation's ability to absorb a significant immigrant population. As a result, Tuvalu has one of the lowest immigration rates in the world, with its citizens forming the vast majority of the population. Tonga, a Polynesian kingdom with tight-knit communities. Tonga, a Polynesian kingdom located in Oceania, boasts a strong sense of national identity and tight-knit communities. This, along with its limited economic opportunities and remote location, has contributed to a low immigration rate. The Tongan government prioritizes protecting its cultural heritage and values, making it difficult for foreigners to obtain permanent residency. Thank you for joining us. If you found this video informative and engaging, don't forget to drop a like, share your thoughts in the comments, and subscribe for more video like this. Until our next journey, stay tuned and take care.